Ex-champion Pinklin Thomas challenges Mike Tyson for the heavyweight championship. Las Vegas, 30th of May, 1987. Here we go, and immediately Thomas is nailed with the right hand. This is round one. Thomas ties up Mike Tyson. People don't like to see Tyson get tied up. Thomas making a mistake. If he turns his head to the left or to the right and bends forward, Tyson will nail him. Tyson really aggressive after Piglin Thomas. Walks into the left hand again. Of course, Mike Tyson favored to win the fight. Tyson looks so strong against Piglin Thomas. Thomas already has a look of concern on his face, and he's nailed immediately by Tyson. Nobody has been so menacing coming into the ring since maybe Sonny Liston as Mike Tyson. Everybody that faces him within 20 or 30 seconds of the first round of the fight has total fear of him. And it's beginning to look like Nicola Thomas can't keep him off with his left jab at all. Tyson is just coming right through it. Right through the jab, uppercut. Tyson is so strong, he has no fear of anybody. The left jab can't keep Thomas off. Tyson pours in. Piglet Thomas is puffy around the left eye. It looks like he's puffy around the right eye as well. And Tyson totally controlling this first round. Piglet gets nailed again. A little more than halfway through the first round. And it's been all Mike Tyson. Thomas can't keep the jab in the face of Mike Tyson. Thomas may be cut on the left cheek. His right eye is already puffy. Mike Tyson totally controlling this round. Uppercuts, left hands, right hands. Tyson's controlling things. Oh, a big left hand and a right hand nails Thomas. Thomas is almost ready to go. He gets hit with an uppercut. Thomas is nailed again. Mike Tyson in the process of destroying Piglin Thomas in round number one. You see the time remaining, 20 seconds to go. Thomas is almost out on his feet, getting hit with uppercuts. Thomas fighting back awkwardly. It's the first time I've seen him look awkward like this. Piglin has no power in his left hand to keep him off. He nails Tyson with the right hand. And the bell ends round number one. Okay. You're getting butted. You're getting butted all over the joint. He's all right. But he's all right. Leave him the f alone. Be quiet, Angelo. But leave Pinky, him alone. Pinky, look up at me. Leave him alone. God damn it. Leave him the f man alone. Right. Get away from this man. You guys got to do it. All right, here we go. Round number two. Thomas had better get that left jab in the face of Mike Tyson, and there's going to be some serious problems. Now, Padilla wants Tyson about hitting on the clinches and on the breaks. Thomas trying to get up on his toes. Wild right hands missing that cheek and the cut of Piglin Thomas. Tyson not doing what Mitch Green did, not doing what Bone Crusher Smith did, and that's hang on. Tyson just came out so strong and immediately nailed him and intimidates the guy right from the beginning. Now Thomas starting to hang on a bit. A left jab right in the face of Thomas. Now Thomas begins to pick out up, try to pick up the face a bit anyhow. Tyson just walks right through that jab. Nice combination of Thomas and Smith. The crowd booing, they don't like it when people hang on to Tyson. Left hook gets through. 
Piglin's wide open for the right hand, too. He's carrying that left hand low, and Tyson will come right after him with the right. See what I mean? See that left hand hanging down there? Tyson's got much quicker hands than people realize, too. He comes right after him, wild with left and right. Thomas has been in fights before, but never anything where a guy is just so vicious as this guy. <laughs> Again, Thomas is really considered the second best fighter in the world today. You might get some argument out of Michael Spinks. You might even get some argument out of Tony Tucker now, the new IBF champion. But there's no question about the fact that Mike Tyson is considered the guy. Closing second of round number two. Bob Sheridan here in the Don King Sports and Entertainment Network. And there is some excitement as the bell ends round two. After the first two explosive rounds, Tyson remains on top in rounds three, four, and five. Round six coming up. Padilla having a little trouble separating the two fighters. Real good left. Oh, nice uppercut score that time. Followed by a left hook by Tyson. Thomas now trying to hang on, trying to keep those hands from nailing him. He doesn't want to allow those hands to get inside of his. Now there's blood coming from the mouth of Piglin Thomas. Big left hook. Thomas looks like he's ready to go. He better hang on. Nail with the right hand. Thomas is in a heap of trouble. He's getting nailed by Tyson. This could be it. Thomas really nailed. Big left hook, big right hand. Down it goes, Piglin Thomas. I don't know if he can get up from this. Really, really nailed. The count is up to five six, and six, seven. seven. It's up to eight, nine. nine. And that's it. The referee stops the fight. Angelo Dundee says no. The corner cannot stop a championship fight. I think he counted him out. I'm not sure if that's going to be scored as a TKO or a knockout. I think he may have counted him out. We'll have to wait and get the official scoring. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, watch the uppercut that starts this mess. Bang, there it is. And right at this stage now, Piglin Thomas, you can see his knees start to buckle. And from that stage, it was just about curtains. There's another angle of it. Then the left hand at this stage. Piglin Thomas is all through. You'll see him crumble down to the canvas. A punishing left hook, and that's it. At this stage, his eyes are out, his head will go straight down. There's the left hand, solid. The uppercut sets things up. The left hook, you can really see the concussion of that left. Another left right at the eye. That's a vicious left hook. He's out right now. A two left hand from up above. The left hand, right not too heavy, but a vicious left hand. And it's all over right here. Piglin Thomas is gone. The winner by a TKO and still WBC, WBA, heavyweight champion of the world, Iron Mike Tyson. <laughs>